Hi guys, um, so I just want to share with you something about one of your assignments before we get, you know, two units into the course and you don't know that you had to do this. So you have um, Learn Smart assignments for every chapter and these are the virtual versions of the book. So yes, you should be reading at home. The Learn Smarts are um, the virtual version of the book and they're going to give you the opportunity to read but if you've read at home you don't have to sit and read the whole thing again but what you need to be doing is click you click on these so when you are in your learn smart click on these three buttons over here okay and you have these things over here that you need to be paying attention to table of contents is going to give you each of your chapters Read is going to give you this look that you're seeing right now where you can actually read the book. What you need to be completing are the practice questions. Okay, you are going to get questions. She's going to talk to you. Um, and you need to answer them. Okay, so you need to click, click what you think is right. A living thing exhibits all five properties of life and is composed of one or more blank, the basic units of life. So what's the basic unit of life? Well, a cell is. So I'm going to click cell, and I'm going to say that I know it. My answer is correct. So then it allows me to move on. Okay. Now, particles that make up molecules are called... Well, maybe I don't know this one, so I'm going to say organisms, and I'm unsure. Okay, my answer is incorrect. They're going to tell you to go read about it, okay? Now, here's the thing you need to know. The more questions you get wrong, the longer the assignment takes you, okay? The more questions you get right, the faster the assignment will go, okay? So if you keep missing a bunch of questions, then it's going to keep sending you back and giving you more and more questions, okay? So the idea is if you don't know about it, go read about it and then come back and answer the question. This should be an easy 100 points for you no matter what, as long as you get them by the, done by the end of the, or by the due date, which is generally the due date is always the day before the test, so you have plenty of time to get them done. It's just whether or not you plan to get them finished. So you need to go into the Learn Smart Assignments, and then you need to click these three buttons, the three lines. Okay. Read will give you the reading look. Sorry, I'm so congested. And then, oh, sorry. Well, maybe I'm going to show you that again. Okay, yeah, here we go. You want to click those three buttons up here. It's slow, it's slow, it's slow. And then practice, okay? So you can see in unit one or chapter one, I answered that one question. I'm 2% of the way done, okay? And practice is where you're going to get those questions. Okay, so you need to be going in there and you need to be doing those. That's a, the easiest 100 points you're going to get in this course, seriously. And it's an, it's an opportunity for you to practice what you've read. So maybe you need to be reading the material before you come and do the Learn Smart assignments. Okay, or maybe you need to have your actual book with you while you're doing it. That's fine too. You need to figure out what works for you, but this is an easy 100 points to really hit those really important concepts for the chapter that you're going to need to know. Okay, so they're important. So make sure you're doing those and get those 100 points. Um, I don't want anybody to say halfway through the semester they didn't know they were supposed to be doing these. So here's the information, okay?